Another important element in a template are the decorations you may have in, the t uh, in it. Usually these are only bitmaps and this may be a problem because AlbumDS templates resize automatically to new resolutions and sizes and bitmaps may lose definition on the edges. Then the best option is to convert these bitmaps into shape layers. This is easily done by just control clicking at the actual decoration and getting a selection of this size. Now you may use Album DS Extras Selection to Shape to get a shape layer with the same size and position as the bitmap. You only have to change the color field, the opacity, and you get the same as you had before, but in a vectorial shape layer. Vectorial shape layer doesn't lose definition if you change them resizing the template. It's important to rename uh, the shape layer to any other name to just not confuse it and don't apply a picture to it. And you may also change the color of the layer, just a normal no color. But of course you are not limited to rectangles or squares. You may draw a selection from any shape form you want, just like this. This is a selection and now use Album DS Selection to Shape to get a shape layer of this form. Here we have. Of course you may apply a picture to the shape. Mm -hmm. Let's create a round one and I'll show you. We select Elliptical Marquee Tool. We draw a circle. Then using Album DS we make it a selection and now we apply a picture. Here we are, a round shape layer with a picture. Remember also that you may use the rectangle tool as a ellipse tool or rounded rectangle tool to create the shape layers directly without having to convert them with Album DS. Just click at for example rounded rectangle tool and you will get a new shape layer ready to be applied to a picture. Let's apply one and you will see the effect. here, rounded corners. You may change the radius of the corner here at the options of the rectangle tool here. 